Welcome back to Site Tech Intermountain training videos. In this video, I wanted to show you how you could connect to your 855 base to your computer through an IP address. So on the back right here, you can see that this is an SPS 855. And what we're gonna do is connect to it with a ethernet cable. So I've got my ethernet cable connected to my computer and I've got it right here on the back, connected to the back. Once you've done that, the way you find the IP address for your base station is to hit the up arrow once. If you click once, right there you can see that's the IP address. So open up a web browser on your computer and actually type that in. 169.254.1.0 and it will come up to the web page of the actual base. Now, if it's the first time that you're going into your base, your username is admin, and for the password, it's lowercase password. So lowercase on both of those, for the A for admin and then password, hit OK. Now, what it's gonna want you to do is change that password also, so you can change that in your security option here on the bottom left, you can change the password. So username, well, you're still gonna put in admin, New password, I'm going to put Intermountain1 with a capital I. Hit OK, and then you can update that. So if you needed to do any upgrades to it, you can hit the firmware option right here, and you can install on the right side right here. This one is out of date, but it's currently running version 5.48. This is where you could actually choose a file that you've actually picked for this, which is a TIMG file. So you can choose the file, and once it's uh, brought in right here and downloaded, you can install the firmware right there. Thank you for watching this video from Site Tech Intermountain on getting into an 855 base with a Ethernet cable.